Hello guys and welcome to Till Vacuum Do Us Part. Today's video is an Amazon video. I know how much you guys love them. I love them too, but I'm also adding Walmart and Target to the list because I'm gonna be talking about my favorite organizers that you guys see me use in my home all the time and some new ones I ordered to work on my space for this year. That's gonna be an upcoming video, so don't miss out. I just wanted you to see all my favorite products that just make my life so much easier and my house looks so much nicer. So let's go ahead and get started in today's video hey what's your secret you got the kind of that leaves when speechless it could be model multitasking the first product we're going to talk about is something i get asked about all the time like as soon as i open up my makeup drawer i start getting a ton of questions about this organizer now to be honest the one i got was from a different website but i found it on amazon and i even think this one's prettier so i'll be switching mine out and it may even hold more but the way I use this is for my makeup. So all my compact cases. So like my eyeshadow, my blush, my powder, stuff like that. It keeps it nice and organized. Um, you can grab what you need. It's not like stacking on top of each other. It's not gonna get broke. I feel like this is such a cool thing. You could also use this for like earrings or jewelry. If you don't want it to get tangled, you can either like lay it out for the week. I feel like you can do so many cool things with this. I think nail polish would even fit if you have the right size, like two would probably fit in each of them. So it's not just for makeup, but that's what I use my for. And it just helps my drawer look more organized. Plus I can find all the products that I need when I need them. Now I'm gonna be talking about all different styles of organization, but I have some too that aren't just like bins, but you're gonna see me talk about a lot of bins today. And I will say if they don't fit in your drawer perfectly, they tend to slide and it drives me crazy. It may not drive you crazy, but it drives me crazy. So you can get this museum wax off Amazon and it's clean clear so that you don't see it. So if you have like a clear organizer like this one, you stick it to the bottom and then press it down on your drawer and then it won't slide around. It's not gonna damage your drawer. If you need to move it later, you can, you just pick it up. It's a lot like Tiki Tac. So Tiki Tac would work too, but basically this is just clear and a little bit nicer if you don't wanna see like white marks underneath your clear container. So I'll definitely have this link for you as well. So I do have a drink fridge in our utility room if you're new here, and I always just have them stacked up normal. But I will say like, as you take them, then all the pop just ends up in the back. And then I'm trying to like pull it forward. And I'm trying to put like the new ones in the back cause they're not as cold. Um, so I finally picked these up from Walmart. So this came as a four pack. Um, but what's so nice is they just keep like rolling towards you. So I'm gonna put them in here. And then when I take one, it kind of rolls down. And I think this is gonna function so much better. Um, I can't wait to try this out. If I haven't mentioned this yet, I am gonna be doing a whole declutter. No, I've already done the whole declutter, a whole organizational video. And you're gonna be seeing me use all the products that I'm talking about in today's video. So if you wanna see how I use them, definitely be on the lookout for that. Make sure you're subscribed. But this is a product I'm excited to get into our fridge. Now let's talk about some closet organization because I feel like that's where we could all use some help. Um, this was a new one I got because Chase has belts. I really don't have any belts. I may have one that I have like underneath a shelf or something, but I thought this was really cool because you can just hang it up and then I brought his belt in there so I could show you guys. You just hang it on there and then they don't get tangled up. You can see everything you have. So it works really well for that. Um, I also brought some jewelry because I thought it would work really well for necklaces too. If yours get tangled, but you want them out where you could see them, you could add jewelry to this. You could do sunglasses, you could do scarves, um, basically anything. So you have to think outside of the box when you're thinking about organization you definitely have to get creative because just because this is for belts doesn't mean you couldn't hang tons of other items from this as well this a next product i've shared something very similar to this before but this one's different so basically this is to hang your purse on and then your strap doesn't get bent so if you have a nice purse or a leather strap and you don't want it like creasing at the top or you just want it to look really pretty hanging. I feel like these are so pretty just to hang your purse on. I did bring mine in here. So the last one I have, Savannah's still using, but the whole thing is the same material. And so you can't spin the top. What I like about this one is if you wanna spin it, so like maybe it's on a different coat rack, maybe you wanna angle your purse towards you, this does move. And for me, I like that. But now I wanna show you like, all you do is like hang your purse over it and see how it doesn't bend the strap. It keeps it nice, just like it would on your shoulder. So you don't have to worry about messing up like your handbags or anything like that. Even if it's not like a luxury handbag, like 
it's even nice with like cheaper bags because they tend to crease even more and then it just looks really pretty hanging. So when it comes to my closet, I always try to tell you guys to organize it or set it up like it's a store. Set it up like you're going shopping and so display items, um, group light things together, color code, all those things. And so I've always wanted to display my purses and so I've seen a ton of girls use these like purse stands which once again you could use them for so many different things but they're kind of pricey. I found a really good deal for a four pack and I'm hoping it's still on sale when this goes live. So definitely check it out. It may not last long. I didn't know if the gold was going to be kind of like cheesy yellowy since it was like a better price, but it is beautiful. It's a beautiful gold. They are adjustable. So like if you have a longer strap purse, you just pull it up and then there's a little screw right here. You tighten, but all you do is like hook your purse onto it. And then like what I would do too is I'd have this in there in my purse, but then you just hang it and you set it on a shelf and it looks so high end. It looks nice. It's displayed pretty. It just makes your closet feel special. And sometimes we just need a few special things. Like, is this necessary? No, not at all. So if it's not in budget, don't get it. It's just something fun to have if you want to create that vibe in your closet. That's like, a store. okay, one last purse item. I guess I was in the mood for purses when I was ordering, but I've had something like this before and I loved it. And it's my bigger purses. So the purse you just saw, it wouldn't work in, but if you have any like totes or, you know, carryalls, something that has no storage in it, it doesn't keep its shape well. You're like constantly digging to the bottom to like figure out where your wallet are, your keys and all of that. I have the solution. They make these now and they come in all different colors. They're super affordable. Like you can't break it. Um, you can get all organized inside. Do you see all the different pockets and storage and zippers? all of it inside, outside. And what's so nice is if you like to switch your purses, you can just take this out of the purse and drop it into your new one. So if you are one of those, you like change your purse every day to match your outfit. I'm not one of those girls. I think it's so cool when people do it. Um, I just don't have the time, <laughs> um, but this makes it so much easier. You're not having to switch piece by piece over. You just pull this out and put it in. Now there are different colors. So if you have like a black purse and you want a black one, or if you have a tan purse and you want a tan, if you're okay with it, just being one color go super neutral and then you can just plop it into any purse but I feel like this is so nice to have get that purse organized we're talking about organizing our home but get your closet get your purse get your car get everything organized just so you have a really good smooth calming year Okay, the next product I bought um, about a month ago, and as soon as I put it in my closet, I wanna say it comes as a four pack. Um, Savannah immediately grabbed some and used them too. So they're really fun. They don't seem necessary, and you wouldn't think they'd make such a big <laughs> impact, but I'm gonna show you inside my closet um, so you can see they do. But they're dividers for your shelf. So like, say you have a lot of purses lined up, say you have a lot of yoga pants and pants lined up or whatever, sweaters these slide onto your shelf right here like this is adjustable you're just gonna slide on and then it divides them up so once again it's like a store it looks super high end it just looks glamorous once again you don't have to have this this isn't one of those things that i'm like you have to have this to survive it's a game changer it's a look changer it just makes things look more polished um savannah has them in between some of her shoes you could do this in between like your beauty products or skincare or whatever it is um, but i just think it's really cool Okay, so this next product I've been talking about for several years, you guys have bought so many of them. Chase is still using it, so I know it's a hit. I know you're gonna love it, but how many husbands, boyfriends, maybe yourself, have like a ton of hats by a show of hands? Chase has always had a ton of hats. It's kind of like, you know, a girl with shoes or purses or jewelry or whatever your thing is, he has hats. Um, but they were always just like stacked on top of each other. They were falling over. He didn't wear the ones in the middle because he didn't know he had them. You know, it's like that whole thing. Then I found this organizer on Amazon and it hooks to any hanger. So you get this piece. I want to say it comes in different colors, but we have black and it comes in a set. So you could share them. You can get one, say your husband only has this many hats. He doesn't need the second one. You could share it, but then they just hang and you can see all of the hats. So you can be like, I want to wear the blue one. And you just like release it and have it. And then he can hook it back in later, but super, super nice to have. And then it hangs up 
just like a shirt or pants in your closet so it doesn't have to take up a lot of space if you need like most people have more hanging space than shelf space so maybe you can free up shelves for more shoes or purses and then hang up their hats okay so i've been seeing these a lot of places and i thought it would be really nice to have so in my house we pretty much have all white bedding like no matter when i'm doing laundry it's white bedding and so most of the time it doesn't matter because i'm just doing one room at a time but i have a lot of extra sheets especially when guests come in and it's nice now especially like in a guest closet i can have all the sheets together first off this holds them together so a whole set can be in here so i know it has all the pillowcases the top sheet the duvet whatever you need like my host can know it's in there but then it's good for me because i know what size sheets they are so if i need a set of king i can grab them if i need a set of queen i can grab them um you can get it in like full and twin but we don't have those size beds in our house but we do have queens we do have kings and i just think to be so nice to have i'm gonna put them on all my sheets immediately and i think it's nice like the sizing's nice but i think it's more the band that i'm gonna be able to keep like all of my sets together and they're not gonna get mixed up in the place that i keep them. okay now we're slowly making our way into the kitchen area and we're slowly going out of amazon i have a few more amazon products and then we'll start going into walmart but i ordered these organizers it comes in a small box there's a pack of four they come in different colors but this you peel off and it's sticky and you stick it to like the back of your toaster maybe it's an air fryer um whatever you have and then you wrap the cord around it so there's not just cords out everywhere maybe even you keep appliances on your countertop and you don't leave them plugged in you could still wrap it up where it's behind it or on the side so the cord's not everywhere i have a thing with cords if you're new here you're gonna see me always talk about cord gadgets or hiding them or tricks or hacks i do not like seeing cords so this is going to be super nice to have i'm not going to lie it's been so hard like not organizing as all these products come in savannah loves to declutter she loves to organize and she's like itching to do things and so we've started a little bit i've been saving some for the video but something we've really gotten into are these labels from amazon and i've ordered three different packs i'm gonna link some for you down below but we switched over like our spice um labels so at my last house and pantry i needed them on the front because they were like eye level were now like they're in a drawer so i see the top and these were just so nice they look so high end i love their black they fit the top of my bottles i'll link both if you haven't switched your spices over to matching bottles game changer as well get this on top there may even be sets that have both so i'll link them for you but i just feel like they look so nice and they're helpful but we also got these home labels and they sold me because it said minimalist labels so i like things that's not super crazy but you guys are gonna laugh so we've used so many of these already look at this like we've been grabbing them and using them i'm trying to film it for you guys because i'm filming that organizational video but i wanted to show you like these labels are gorgeous they even come with like extra ones so if you have your own thing and you want to take like a white paint pen or chalk marker and write them on but they are gorgeous labels what's nice is like if you don't get them on perfectly they still peel off so you can put them back on i mean you can only do it a few times but they do hold up it's not like once they're stuck they're stuck but we have loved these i'll probably show you some clips after this um like of a few insider cabinets that we've already done like it completely elevates the space one more amazon product that that I forgot about what that was on the table and then we'll move on to Walmart but it's these clear drawer dividers so if you don't have drawer dividers in general they come in um like why I had like white plastic ones to begin with like a few houses ago I think they have like wood ones different places but the clear I'm really liking um and basically you just put these in your drawers and they go to whatever size you need and then it keeps things from rolling around so I have them here in my kitchen and multiple drawers to like divide the towels I have them with all like my hot tools and my bath bathroom i have these in my dresser like you know sorting like my pajamas i use these everywhere they're so nice so sleek they just kind of elevate the space and they keep your stuff from like sliding around everywhere in your drawer okay now we're gonna go ahead and start with the walmart products which i love the home edit collection they're beautiful they're affordable you don't have to go to the crazy container store and spend all the money 
Plus they come in sets, which is good and bad. So what's nice is you can see, it's like the six piece home office drawer edit. It tells you everything it comes with, how to display it. But just remember, if you're needing these size containers, you don't have to get it just for your office. Like I got these for our bathroom or for our kitchen. So just look at the actual products and be like, can I use this? Is this where I need it? But if you need help narrowing down, it is nice that they come in sets so you get a chunk of them to mess around with. So I bought this set. I bought so many sets, guys. So, so many sets. Um, this one, I think, was the silverware set, which I already have. I'll show you a clip of that. But I love using these in desk drawers. I love using these with beauty products. Like, I'm mainly just focusing on the size, not what they're calling it, but the size of the containers. Like, these are really good for makeup brushes or your hairbrush or silverware as well, but like tools, different stuff like that. It doesn't just have to be for your kitchen. Um, a new one that I felt like was new, I haven't seen it before, was this makeup one. It's an eight piece beauty drawer edit. It looks gorgeous. Can you see that? I'm gonna link as many as these that I can down below, but it, it just has some really nice sets in it. Um, they have some that have dividers in them. They have some that don't. Um, I think this one was from the pantry or the laundry room set. I love that it's like narrow, but it's super deep. This is really good for like popcorn containers. Savannah uses it for like um, her cleaning products like Method and stuff like that. It's narrow. I love that it has the handle. Um, they even have like sets that have like the big containers in them. If these look dirty, it's because I've been using them for a while. They have small ones. So they're just a beautiful set. Um, and it comes in a set. Now, if you're not needing a set, we're gonna be talking about, we'll go ahead and go into Target. I think that was on my Walmart. So Target has a line as well that looks just like the Home Edit. They have all different sizes, but they don't come in sets, which is kind of nice when you're like, I just need one or I just need two. So let me grab those so I can show you a few of their options. Okay, so Target's version is called Bright Room and they have a ton of organizing options. So definitely check it out. I wouldn't to show you a side by side this is target this is um walmart the home edit it is pretty much identical the home edit is maybe just a smidgen longer yeah just by a little bit but for the most part you can tell like it may even look a little different like this one's planer at the top or this has like a little bit of a lid it doesn't matter they're both gonna work really well so check out prices see what you have available both are gonna work but i did want to show you a side by side Another style organizer that both Walmart and Target carry, it looks identical, are these white ones. They do have a flat lid, I didn't bring it in here. Um, but they can stack, they're perfect for nightstands, they're perfect for beauty products, they're a little bit more affordable, and they come in all different sizes. I think you have a lot more size options at Target. So they go down to super tiny to really big. So if you're gonna stick with the white ones, I would suggest going um, to Target. Whereas every time I'm at Walmart, they basically have this size, so there's less options, but they're still great. I use these for all of our nail polishes. Um, I have these in both of our nightstands with like different things in them. So they're still really nice, but they're more affordable. We are getting close to being finished, but you've seen clear containers, you've seen white containers. Now we're gonna talk about some black containers because my next video is going to be a pantry organization. I'll probably be filming that tomorrow. Um, so be on the lookout for that, but I'm wanting to switch it up like I don't put all of my food into clear containers now it was a lot of work I really want to go back to it I just feel like there's so much like color in my pantry that it stresses me out so I'm trying to add black I feel like it'll hide the color a little bit more if I don't want to be like dumping out all of my products into clear bins um, so I picked up some black bins from Target and they had some beautiful options so this is the first one I felt like canned foods would look good in here chips Oops. let's see if the price is still on this it's not um but i think it's that same yeah bright room bin so definitely check out it's the section like right behind the kitchen area but they have some really pretty pieces this would look nice setting out like you could decorate with this it could go on the end of a bed it could go in the bathroom it could go on your fireplace with something really really beautiful pieces to have the next piece i picked up was more in the kitchen area for kitchen organization and it was cheaper it's more of a plastic but i loved that it was solid black so it would hide um it had the cutout so keep in mind with these cutouts if you use it you can leave it that way 
If you don't want to use it, all you have to do is flip it around and you don't even notice it's there. So it's kind of a two for one. So if you can't decide, like if you want the cutout and the clear bins, you can just turn it around and then it doesn't have it. But this shows using um, them for like your storage containers fitting in there, water bottles. I'll probably do chips and different things, but I grabbed quite a few of these to use. And the last two products I bought are like from the same collection, but I thought these were gorgeous. I feel like they're gonna hold up over time. I could fit some really big pieces into this. So this could hold paper towels, toilet paper, you know, any of your overflow items, tons of bags of chips, whatever you have to. And then they did have different sizes. There was a medium that I didn't grab. This is the smaller size. It's called a mesh bin. Once again, it's the bright room. Um, I thought for this, it would be like breakfast bars, different small things like that, oatmeal, um, hot cocoa packets. This would be good in a bathroom. You could keep stuff in. Like it just looks high end. So if you're wanting to organize, but go a little bit high end, go a little bit moody or trendier, you can definitely gravitate towards the black elements. Um, look it up on Pinterest. There's some really cool pantries with black in them. And I'm hoping, crossing my fingers, I can pull something off like that. Pantries are really hard for me, but I'm hoping like with the pop of like wood and black in there, we can make it look really cool and like less colorful. I have one last product I forgot about. It was at my feet. I was keeping a lot of the bins in it, but I've had these for a while. They are huge. Like I have three of these in our work closet. I've had them since our last house. They are so nice to keep stuff in. You can't mess them up. They're like a really nice felt almost, but like they don't smash down. You know what I mean? Like they don't collapse. They hold their shape. You can haul stuff around. These are good to throw like kids toys in, blankets, like they're big. If you carry a lot of stuff in your car, you could leave it in the back of your car and then you just carry it in and out. Like I said, I've had these, they still have this color, but I went in um, a few days ago and they had like a really nice charcoal gray, super nice looking. So if you wanna get that color, I'd grab them because I bet you they'll go fast. Okay guys, I think we did it. I am surrounded by organizers right now. What's funny is I have even more. This was just like one of each. I bought multiples. And so like my pantry is a disaster right now. Chase's office is a disaster, but I know once we're done organizing, everything's gonna look so nice. Plus I enjoy keeping extra bins and I'm gonna find a place in my house to keep them. Savannah likes to organize a lot and so I feel like we're constantly like taking organizers from one space and moving them to the other. So we're just always short. We're always just like shuffling them around. So I definitely wanna have overflow like I do with my home decor. I wanna have like a organizational bin. So when we need something, we have it on hand. So I'm so excited. So like I mentioned earlier, I'm gonna be having my pantry organization video coming up next. So make sure you're subscribed. If you want to see how I use all of these products that you saw in today's video, that will be the next video after the pantry video. It's going to be a whole house organization and I'm working on everything. And then by the end of the month, I'm going to do a whole like home tour organization. Like I'm going to take you into drawers and pantries. You guys let me know. Let me know down below in the comment section what you want me to show you in the home tour. I'll open up cabinets, all of that so you can see how everything turned out. So make sure you're subscribed here. I have so much exciting content coming out for you guys this year. I'm so thankful you're here. I have all of today's links down below in the description box. I hope you guys have a wonderful week and I will see you in the next one. Bye. Oh, hey, but the cup won't you listen? Oh.